Hey guys, welcome to Fire Emblem. Ah, uh, the legend, the king of the Dane lies at the northernmost edge of Telius. I don't have much of a thing, but yeah, Dane winters are raw and brutal. You know, like my sex life. The most first general icon of Crimean army, president of forward. Benyon's Imperial Senate may have lent Carmia troops, but even they doubt the army can be successful for enough Dane. Yet somehow, I can come to defy all odds and capture victory after victory. Bracing both Prince of Lysia's dream and Dilbury Carmia and the tragic history of his parents, I can march in grim silence. Yeah, that was a long cutscene last time, huh? Yeah, man. Kind of sucks your parents died or whatever, Ike, but like, yeah. At least well promoted. <laughs> okay, this is kind of. This is a little fucked, not gonna lie. Because, um. He, okay, Soren. Steve, someone's venting. Ike, are you alright? Oh, yeah, sorry, what is it? I mean, I was just giving you a standard update. Shall I put it off till later? No, I'm sorry. Can you start from the beginning? I'll pay attention this time. Understood. Good morning, you two. What's wrong, Ike? You look so sleepy. I have had a lot on my mind. I tried to sleep last night, but I was up thinking. Before I knew it was morning. Really? I never thought I'd hear that. I didn't sleep much because he was thinking. What if someone were stopped being polite? Listen, Tania. Can I just... Hey, but brother, Ike. What's wrong, Mist? I'm gonna do, Ike. My medallion is gone. God fucking damn it. What, it's gone? No. It says it's gonna do. I was like, leave my until my mother. Do you drop it? Or put it somewhere and forget? Something like that? No, I'll just carry it with me. I would never lose it. That's what I passed last night. I finished while I was sleeping. <laughs> uh... Don't cry. It's not your fault. But, but... I said don't cry. I'll find it. All right? Uh, all right. I'm sorry. Uh... Wow. I sure am glad we know what that's, you know, a bad thing. Oh, are you serious? You are to begin immediately. Yeah, that's General Petrine. If we do this, Dane will suffer. It's for the good of the country. Besides, it is only one territory. Stop mewling around like an old woman. I hear you, and yet... The goal is merely to stop the Crimean army. That's not necessary. The strength of my troops will suffice, but... The last idiot who told me that ended up in a corpse pile. Now listen to me and listen well. And imagine how passionate you are whenever you tell me I'll right, defeat Crimea. I'll never pin my hopes on a bunch of foreigners. All I have to do is stop their forward products. That's all. My plan will accomplish this. General Petrine. Do you truly think so little of us? Truly we were born in Savignon and not Dane, but my men and I have been lords of the country for 18 years. It's been no effort to learn all the proper manners and customs of this land. Now, before that, we've missed it as a bunch of foreigners. No one asks how long you've lived here. Want to know why? Because no one cares. Certainly not me. Were you raised? Where were you born, huh? Where were you raised? <laughs> this country doesn't need squatters like you. The only, the only people Dane count on time crisis are Danes themselves. Everyone else is just gutter leavings. So useless. Is that what you're saying? You tell me, migrant. Why is it your unit, which is trained to be an elite royal guard, is here patrolling the Hicks and Hess in the backwater? That's clear to me. How about you? I, I... Oh, I'm sorry. Am I offending you? Well, here's your chance to show us what you're worth. Halt crime is events. Your skill as you claim, you should be able to limit the damage to the bare minimum, should you not? Ugh. <laughs> Angry is a good look for you. I look forward to seeing the results of your work. Get going, Outlander. General Shisharam, we surely go through this. It's such a horrific act. So the reason that the demons hereabouts you can come to trust us. We have no choice but to obey. So the woman says, the only thing we can do is ensure the Korean army is defeated as soon as possible. General. Open the floodgates. Do it now. I could just a bit more as you don't ask for my idol. Uh, sure, go ahead, please. Very well. Nephany, MVP, nice. No deaths and injuries. Been our cape as a hill. Everyone performs exceedingly well. That's all with your leave? I'll excuse myself. We did it. We finally had a good chapter where nothing bad happened. Like, you know, accidentally losing Sean. Wait, what? Anyways. Um, no. Nar. Okay. Varsha, bro, let's just get this out of the way. You let it, everyone in your shots. Okay, the target isn't good enough. My instruction would tell me that I should be able to strike the capsule in my armor plates. It's nearly impossible. But maybe I'll get that one day. Hold on, Rolf. Let me see your hands. My hands? Oh, barnacles. Your hands are going to have blisters and you're bleeding. Or are you still practicing like this? What's wrong with you? I heard it first, but my hands kept numb after a while. She just kept putting clothes out of my quiver. Holy cow, Rolf. You're tough. I'll give you that. Hold still. I still have one around here. There, found it. This may sting a little. Things ah, hurt. That's like for a deadly mercenary like you, right, Rolf? A deadly mercenary, you really think so? It's not just your bowmanship. You're quite tenacious. You're so focused on hitting your targets that you need to feel pain. Few people are that determined. To be able to take the difference, will I be a sight of danger? But that strength stat, no. <laughs> Thanks, Marshall. But it's to you. Rolf, I'll look out for you, too. Oh, my nuts. Why do you have to grow so fast? It really is a tragedy. Um, if race is gonna be with Tormod, do I want to be with Tanith or Oscar? 
I don't know if I want to race in our Oscar. Because Oscar kind of... I feel like he needs a support partner, right? You know? But Tanith and Racing seems pretty good. Also, um... Who do you guys support with anyways? No one. Cool. I might do Tanith and Racing. Sorry, Oscar. You're kind of off on your own a lot, but, you know. Do you have a moment, Prince Racing? Oh, you're the Apostles. Yes, Your Highness. My name is Tanith. And I lead the... I lead the Benyon's Holy Guards of Benyon and I. Pegasus Knights. What brings you here? Once another, the Apostle has ordered me to keep you safe. She's quite sincere in her desire to help. She used redemption for what has happened all these years ago, doesn't she? No need for body cards, I'm protect myself. I mean, no suspect, Your Highness, but... The youngest child in Benyon knows the Heron Clan's anchors fighting. You see, so fine. How you protect yourself? That's my own concern, not yours. I beg to differ. I'm under repeal of orders. I cannot abandon my duty. So your safety is my much my concern. Bjork orders not affect me. Wasting enough time with you. Now excuse me. This guy seems so frail, but it's real strong. It's not going to make it easy for me to protect him. What am I to do? I don't know what are you to do. Nothing. That's what. <laughs> Woman. You who? You there, young man. I have business with the general army. Will you convey a message? Who are you? Who am I? What kind of low-burn greeting is that? My name is Kalil, and I'm a first-class mage. What a first-class mage want with this army? What's your problem? <laughs> you look as you don't believe me. Well, I suppose I can't hold that against you. Not often you find beauty like this couple of intelligence like mine. But it's true nonetheless. A mage, huh? I guess you never have too many mages lying around. Oh, and a bonus, I'm quite skilled with a knife as well. Beauty, brains, and brawn. <laughs> the goddess sees her felt with the abilities of three people into one delectable package. It's like favoritism, doesn't it? Um, hello? Are you listening to me? There's a beautiful woman talking. Yeah, the point is you want to join the crime army, right? How is she planning to charge? Well, aren't you the little businessman? Let's see. How does free sound? Suspicious. What's the catch? I think it's be based on performance. Watch you do in combat and make me an offer. Depending on what it is, I'll decide or not to grace you with my assistance. You're not liking confidence, are you? Of course not. I already told you, I'm a first-class mage. <laughs> Alright, you're in. What, are you just having me decisions like that on your own? Press to speak to the general. I am the general. What? <laughs> it's, it's such a stupid... It's so stupid. Are you going to come down here for a moment? What do you need? That's something I want to ask you about. If I can help, I will. Your, your ancestors. Forget it, it's nothing. What is something wrong? I apologize, please let it go. Since nothing of horrors happened. If you don't want to discuss it, that's your right. However, you're this but feel free to receive me you're safe. Please take care in the future. What do you mean? We the Heron Clan, if we choose, we can read the thoughts of others. Seriously? However, this power there's only available us from a calm and peaceful environment. Here in this fester maelstrom of chaotic emotion, it fills me not. Energy here is warped and distorted. You know, now you mentioned it, Race, are you feeling sick? You're so pale it's hard to tell, but I think your face looks more wan than usual. Pay it no mind, I'm fine. Nothing to prove? Why don't you stay off the battlefield for a while? I can find, I promise. Please, do not give me special treatment. As they give me special treatment goes, I don't really have a choice. I promise King Phoenix just I want to push you too hard. If anything were happening to you, bird clan or something. I see. You can't prepare my debt, but I'm sure it's just a burden. That's not my intention. Hold a moment. Who said anything about you and your burden? Can I engage in combat? So I'm nothing more than an obstacle in the field. Race said no. That's absurd. Do you understand how useful your abilities are? No one else can do things you can. You're irreplaceable. If you're not feeling well, I try to do much. You may not be there when we need you. I'm busy then. So I'm trying to tell you. I blend in you. That's why we need to make sure you stay healthy. In that case, I wouldn't mind taking a short break. Call me anytime. I'll come right away. I got it. Who is who do you support with Cal? Nephany and Tormod. Um, Tormod's with Ra Okay. Tormod could use another support partner, honestly, because if he's gonna be with um Tana's a Tana's gonna be with B with Marsha and an A with Racin. Or Yeah. B with Marsha, A with Racin, Tormod can be a B with Racin and an A with Callow and Nephany can be a B with Callow. Ooh, okay. Okay, I figured. I cracked the code. We're using Callow. Okay, I'm gonna be back after battle craps. All right, uno momento. All right, I'm back for guess what? It's everyone's favorite time. Bonus experience. That skill. Bonus experience. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so. This might be Raw's final promotion. He might get two. He might get two digit strength in his promotion gains. I hope. I really hope. If not, then oh well. But we, we tried. That means he has more movement. That means he can fight more enemies. So he can be big and not go. Okay, Rolf. Okay. Okay. If you're gonna be a problem, I'm gonna be a problem for you. 
I I accidentally kill your mentor. Don't make me do it again. Also, he has this bow equipped. When you forge him, they can change color. I haven't just, you haven't seen that because I don't do it on the screen. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, Rolf. What are you gonna be? What are you gonna be? He's Rolf. What's your strength stat? I don't give a sh yeah. Cool. New outfit. New m more movement. More con. Whatever. I don't give a rat's ass. What's your strength? Ten. He hit ten. He has two. He has doubled his strengths since he promoted. Oh my baby. He gained more. In <laughs> I think he gained more strength in a promotion than he did naturally. Anyways, yeah, we're done. We're done with on here, folks. My Lord Ike, were you able to find the medallion? No, it's gone. I fear Dame might have someone stolen it. What, is such a thing possible? I don't know if degree, but there can be no question date on questioning Dayton's involvement. Is the medallion special? Yes. Oh yes. I beg your pardon? What is it? I says it. I shouldn't have touched a sensitive area. Oh no. It's not you that I don't want to touch personally. So that's if it's gonna be sensitive areas, so I'd rather have Randall for Soren here instead. <laughs> it's a private matter. Oh, I see. Ike. What is Dolky? I didn't know you guys did things. <laughs> Rushing water. Of course, in the map, there's a large river up ahead. Let's what you hear. This is a natural. Warped. It's not the sound of a normal weather. General Ike, we got, we got trouble. Well, how can that be? Perhaps it's local rivers flooded. The whole region is soaking wet. Is road completely impassable? No, sir. We can move forward, but the water's turned to ground to mud. Water is still falling at tremendous rates, sir. This can cut back our speed dramatically. It's worked with Dane. They thought to impede our progress in order to gain some time for themselves. And they've succeeded. Well, there's nothing we can do. There's one way to flood. You're able to flood the road. Only which they approach. There must be floodgates in the area. If we can close them. You'll shut off the flow of water, right? Makes sense. Let's get this guy that's looking for gates. What's that? Hey, if you're looking for something, leave it to me. I am the Hawking's eyes, after all. What do you mean? These peepers of mine can see for miles and miles. <laughs> some Lucas power. You're a hawk of the eyes. A, a, a hawk. And beats your fantastic wit. My ass is, isn't a racial ability. It's just my own national talent. Heck, my how Oki has ears and your grass growing on the other side of the country. I see well. My job's yours. Do you think you can flood floodgates? Sleep for something is a lot of water and pouring out, right? I can handle that. That's kind of cool they like. They do this. Is this going to be from... No. It, there's still comes in some random corner, which, man, these these mountains look like ass, but, like, it's an old game. Crime and arm is here. All troops form... Follow them up. Surround them all. Don't let a single one escape. Now, Shaharam is actually... Um, I'll go and set it. So these are the floodgates. Get them closed. The world we're seeing about 12 hours or so. All right, let's get going. Do we have enough to bring... Ooh, I don't want... This is kind of... Okay, this is where cuts are made. Scratch that, I guess I'm not using Kalil, but I am using Tormod, so I don't know who to bunch. You know, logic tells me Rolf, uh, but no. I promoted him, I'm gonna fucking use him. Not racing. Who the fuck do I drop? It kind of isn't good. Well, maybe I don't use Nephany and bring Tormod? I like Nephany, but it's a lot of axe fuckers. Actually, at the same time, though. Mm. I guess I'll drop Nephany for now and bring Tormod instead, just because I need that leather mage. I need him to be here. 20 turns, you have to arrive, which we can definitely do in 20 turns. It isn't, this isn't a tough map, but it's a, a lot happens. And there are secondary conditions that I cannot reach anymore because I done fucked up. I will probably keep Tanith up here, though. Or probably in the back, because she's going to reinforce turn one. So, like... Yeah. Um... I think this is good. Alright. It's time to go. Because reinforcing with her, I mean, at least does clear out the way. You just have to take... You can't take that village if you'd like. There's another village you can take down here. And then on the way up, it's like... I just don't have enough... To, you know, it's nice to seal some of these staves, but I just don't have any of the uses for them. Anything that's droppable? Blizzard, where the fuck are you? Where are you? You're gonna be a pain in my ass. Um... Yeah. Okay. Not too much to really worry about. Apart from the obvious. So, like, we'll... We'll be fine. We'll be good. We'll fuck them up. Alright. And you have the full guard, so I do not care. Really. Nice. Alright, level up. Uh, the only thing is, do I want to Titania to go up there and kill with Marsha too? I don't know. Strength, I'll take it, because you do need strength. You've leveled up kind of eh, honestly. Which is weird, because you're like one of the best units in this game. 
the same time, though, if I can just lure out some of the other fuckers, that'd be pretty nice. Nice. I'll take Adept, I think. I don't remember what skill that is, but I'll take it. And I'll get the other village at some point. Men, yeah. I think I can just take some of them out while I'm here. Meanwhile, the rest of my army, um... Okay. Get a reinforce, call for help. Maybe that was... Maybe moving her all the way in wasn't the best idea. But it's Sanith, I know she'll be fine. But just in case, I will clear out this bottom chunk. Because you're the only one that can hit her, and she should be fine. So I'm just gonna... Gonna fuck shit up a little bit. <gasps> no, he almost kills. Aw. Uh, oh, look at Braum being a good unit. I'm not used to this. I mean, Braum's... I've never had a bad Braum. I've just never had, you know, like, had a good one. <laughs> All right. Iron Blade? Because I can get Ike more forward up, you know. He does need some experience. There is a very good reason to train Ike, and I do need to train Ike, so... Yeah. Eventually, he'll get up there. I just need to get his ass. I need to get him this fucker some levels. Um, can you kill this one? No. Nar, why do you not kill anything? Alright. Well, Tormod, I think, can kill one of these guys, right? Because Tormod's pretty good, yeah. Jesus Christ, Tormod is good. I have to admit, I'm impressed. I'm... Tormod has only done good things. Like, what a good unit. Oh, yeah, I forgot I have a baby man. I, I did kind of burst forge on that, though, unfortunately. Killer bow, it has more crit, so that's good for him, I guess, but we're using the Rolf bolt today. For, the only reason is just so it's safe, so I can save some uses of the, his better weapons. See, look at Rolf being a good unit. I swear, guys, he's not trash. He just acts like it a lot of the time, and by the lot of the time, I mean, like, every single map. But I swear he's good. All right, there we go. Nice job, Zyhark. That's one last man I have to deal with. Um, Chip this man down if you can, and then maybe I'll have Oscar finish him off. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna... Yeah, I, 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 I have to kill. Okay, or Steel Sword? Probably. Bonk. Okay, I think we're done with this first... Um, turn then. We kind of cleared out the town area. We just need to slowly get our way up that little mountain, and we'll be golden. Um, so interesting thing about Shaharam, if for those of you who don't play this game, or it's just a little trivia, even if you have this game, you might know this. You might not. Um, there are trial maps in this game, and you do get characters for beating them, or beating the game multiple times, like they're available in the trial maps, and Shaharam, who is the boss of this, is one of them. So, like, if you did want to use, um... What you call it? Shaharam at some point, you can. I bet you're wondering, this is just a random boss. Like, he's... Yeah, he's a bit um, of a Camus. Like, he's fighting for his nation, but, you know, he's an outsider. There's a bit of, like, empathy there. That was a bad idea. I should have had you guys... Well, actually, no, they'll, they'll kill someone. Um, he is the father of Jill, who we will not see that conversation. If you have her in an A support with um, Leth or Mist, I believe... They actually have a special talk where you can, um, what you call it? If you don't have the support, he will simply turn, Jill will turn coat and fight for her father. So Jill will actually recruit herself to the enemy. I don't know how long the frog is going to remain open until the Crimean army is defeated. So if we wait that long, I'll never probably be drowned. Those aren't quite upset. They might be find much farther. General, enough soldier. You gotta sign me belly. I can take your butt out to the battlefield and kill some Crimean soldiers. Because how do you support this action? This is inhumane. Why does it be ruined? These officers will die. Claim this. Sorry. Even if we claim this next to achieve victory, this is too much. This is Dane's way. Are ready to disobey the king and be put to death for your troubles? Rather die than kill innocent Dane civilians. You see, they just traded the throne. Your parents suddenly lose office. Hey, are we still prepared? Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? Go, fight bravely. Yes, sir. You need to trust the king. We've been kind of cruel and heartless. First time you guys can need to lose and outflanking lands in these public call home. Just a harm. If someone hears the use of the where Lugu is in this country, you'll be granted a traitor. And you're right as always. To live in this land where Lugu is our prejudice, where Lugu's prejudice is so virulent, to steal away everything and know, we know and teach our children to hate all subhumans. I'll not just survive here. It's actually our fault this country is become what it is today. 
And what a terrible miscalculation we made. Even so, I, I hate the idea of furthering the corruption of the Imperial Senate. Can you just thwart you for reasons for leaving Benyon? I have a one favor to ask of you. Say it and it'll be done. Do not fight today. What? Only one side battle. If you're defeated in the end, I want you to care for the survivors and their families. Yes, sir. Commander Shaharim. Commander, it's been many years since you called me that. May the forces of war be with you. The world that's happened, it's been honored to serve with you. Hmm. Uh, well, yeah. So, Jill would recruit Har, but Har is dead, so we'll figure that out later. Yeah. It's interesting. I think you can, in Radiant Dawn, you can recruit yourself into the enemy a couple times, I believe. I know for a fact, because I did this one, it's actually killed him. I, you can recruit in the um, Swamp Chapter. You can have Zyhark talk to Leth or Mordecai, and he'll recruit, even if you're playing the um, the Micaiah side of that one. But I think this this is the first time... I haven't played Effie, I haven't played Thracia, but I'm pretty sure this is the only time in the series where you, one of your units can just flat out recruit themselves to the enemy. Unless you're supportive of Jill or I mean, Leth or Mist, then... Like, Jill will be like something. She'll say something about, you know, not being racist and how she grown and then he's gonna be proud of her or whatever. I don't know. But yeah, kind of fucked up. You're gonna kill one of your, um, your teammates' parents. You know, Fire Emblem, Nintendo, game for all people. Nice. <laughs> We're just gonna clear out this top chunk. If we do, I'm, I'm mad respect, but it's also kind of funny if that's what happens. And especially with forging, this is kind of where this game can get a little easy, is the kind of end game, because you can just, you can really barrel through this entire fucking game if you wanted to. <laughs> like, your units will snowball very quick. Now, not all my units have snowballed, cough, cough, but usually they do. <laughs> um, okay. Alright, he just has bonus advantage, and he doesn't fully kill some of these units. Okay, but that's, that's fine. Uh, okay. There we go. That's a Rolf kill. But I think the game actually does um, the slightly promote that you snowball a little bit, just because how, like, certain maps, I believe, are... Well, not maps, just, like, certain parts of this game, like, the skills, you can invest pretty, pretty smart and, you know, make yourself way better. Okay. We're going to chant for you. Now, even though you're a bird, you don't have Kanto, which is weird, but, you know, at least you get the ring so you can. Or you give it to Tormod, because you think you can be a good healer with that. That, too. Um, honestly, just... Yeah. If you do it twice, then you'll get a... It'll be good. Nah, Nar. Well, I should have seen that one coming. Alright, I will physic up with you, though. Or mend, I mean. Not physic. I'm not burning fucking physic. Not now. Okay. Now, I know that this will do extra damage to Tanith, but I know she can take it, because she has a good chunk of res. So, like, yeah. I mean, what's your attack? Oh, 20, 20, 21? Okay. Uh, even if with that double damage, you do jack to me. Alright. Um, Tanith, get in this man's range, please. Like, let me give you the lawful good. I did give her a, re I did give her a forge. I was trying to think like, well, I know she isn't legitimately authoritarian, but like, they're playing off like she's like a strict um, what should we call it? Um, like she's just kind of strict. Like she's hard. It's tough love, you know. And I was gonna try to do something with that, and then it's like I just couldn't really find anything that I was happy with. So now she just has lawful good, which I mean she is, because she's the closest like a D and D paladin you'll kind of get, you know. It's nothing. I'm like, what? You're level 10. Oh my god. And then again, I guess you're level 7, but still. I think I'm going to have to kill I'm fine burning this one. Um, just Marsha, go and protect the village so I can get it next turn, and then you know, this can be done. You can join the rest of the forces, because you all have a lot of movement compared to my foes. My foot soldiers are very slow. They're very slow and very petite. Um, I can't believe I still have that fucking regal blade. God damn, okay. I could, good. <laughs> All right, ooh, I'm in danger. 
<laughs> He's like a fucking kid. I don't know why they did that. They were just like, oh, you said a bad thing. Ooh. Like, it's just so stupid. I don't know. Kids are kids, though. I don't care. I really should have given Oscar a forge at some point. He just kind of never got it. Although, I think I'd rather hit you, because you're... I think you're more direct pain in my ass. Now, I think Mist does have shade, so it should work against the killer bow guy, because I've now realized I might have done fucked up. And when I say done fucked up, I mean done fucked up, because I kind of need her to, um, to get another character. Sort of? Not really. You know. Kinda. Um. I'm gonna put you one back, because you are very valuable, especially when... It's like, I'd rather lose Tormod than Mist as my healer, but I'd also not... <laughs> I don't want to lose Tormod either. Tormod has been so good. Okay. There we go. Um, I just realized. So... <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so I recorded this one and the last one literally back-to-back -back while I'm doing my laundry. Um, I... I just now realized. Whoops. So, I already created the, like, videos, like, what comes up there with the background and everything for, um, the second part of the Shannon chapter. I realized I killed them by accident, so I need to redo that one. Whoops. Although this should be a, probably a two-parter, so, like, you know, I think it'll be fine. I mean, it depends how quick I can kill the boss. I don't think this should take another... This shouldn't take a couple more turns, I don't think. But also, this is where it gets tough, because there's a lot more enemies concentrated here. Just don't kill Mist. Just do not kill Mist. That's all I care about. Good. Perfect. And Oscar, I don't give a shit. Okay, good. Take the hit. You'll be fine. Mist. <laughs> nice. I think that still burns it. So one of the reasons to use Kalil, honestly, and Tormat, well, especially because, you know, most of my units are kind of... My mages, a lot of them are dead, like Ileana and Soren, is they can be, um, they can use the siege weapons, and siege weapons, even though we have not used one yet, are very good. Did he just park corrosion or cancel or something on that man? Ooh. Actually, yeah. Heal stuff, yay. Okay. Alright, I will see you guys next time for more Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye, everyone.